It's a ghoul rat, too. Man. I think she's gonna have to run back to uh, the rat lane. For, uh... Perhaps for protection. No? Alright. That cool rat. Ah. Alright. Waste of a spell. Petting and uh, feeding bones. Negative energy streams through a tiny fissure, escaping into this world from the Plane of Sorrows. Or is letting, uh, Thera Leak drink a bit of her soul? I think, uh, Bones is still diseased, but that's okay. Oh boy. <laughs> Here's a plague rat. <laughs> That's uh, for bones to chew on. Except she can't get out now. Alright. Not sure where they're uh, coming from either. Just kind of pop out of nowhere. Not even sure where. Alright. Need to go over there. It sounds like uh, disease set in for bones. Yeah. Ability damage. Not sure what, though. All right. Is the rattling still fighting uh, rats? I think, uh, well, I'm just gonna try to rest here, maybe. Probably do it in this corner. <clears throat> Secondary uh, ability damage applied to bones. <laughs> it's not doing well. But it's uh, nothing too important, I think. Intelligence, wisdom, or charisma. I'm not sure which, but uh, nothing critical. All right. There's more dire rat and uh, a regular rat. I think she's going to summon animal. I think the rat lane is coming to help, too. In that case, I think she's going to pull back. Man, 
resorted disease. Well, this is actually good. I think the rattling's gonna help. A little bit. <laughs> oh, man. Steam method. Oh boy, all right. Magic missile. In fact, uh, it looks like three of them. I think uh, that wand already got used up, didn't it? Holy cow. I think there was only one charge in it. It's awfully expensive. They're not, uh, it's, there we go. Oh boy. that the uh, steam methods take additional damage from the uh, rod of frost. <laughs> so it looks like there must be rats in there. Okay. Evidence of the cabin of stone. The thin patina of water seems to shimmer beneath you as you climb. You suddenly realize that the water is running uphill towards the dim light you see above you. So, ascending the, uh, up into the barrel. Problem is, uh, I think there's councilmen that might be there, but, uh, not really anywhere else that I think that we can go. Yeah, to the barrel site. Okay. It would be nice to rest, but, uh, rested too free, too recently ago, so, unable to rest now, but I think... I don't think we're expecting to fight councilmen, so... <laughs> Dripping with the warm, foul-smelling water, you emerge with a gasp. Something's wrong. You can feel it, like a current of electricity arcing through your bones. Time itself seems to stand still. You are in the Barrow site, Brogan's tears welling up before you. Beyond, you can see a small cairn where his arm must once have rested. The altar that once held the Kavanaugh stone lies barren. 
Seize them, cries a commanding voice. Seize the foreigner. If they've come this far, they know too much. All right, well, Lily is uh, clearly outnumbered. Here is uh, Jaeger Steinfor speaking at the head. So she would surrender, or will surrender, I think, but uh, hopefully this isn't interpreted as a provocation. She's just going to say that she's here for the elf. Aye, well, ye shall meet the thieving scoundrel soon enough, admits another. Next time you might think twice before stealing from a barrow dwarf. Why are ye waiting, armsmen? calls a third. Capture him like ye did the elf and seal him in the mines. Your head throbs from the armsman's blows. With wry irony, you remember the night hag sending you here in search of answers. Seek the Kavanaugh stone and you will not fail, she said. She had warned you that the man would be hard to find, but she had said nothing of the price you'd pay to hear his answers. You wonder if you'll live long enough to deliver your message to the king. Voices shatter your reverie. You wonder if you'll even live long enough to see another day. How dare ye and your lapdog elf think to steal the Kavanaugh stone, threatens one of your captors. Into the mine with ye, then. Ye can stay there until the council figures out how it is we intend to hang ye. You close your eyes, grateful for whatever time you've been granted. The elf awaits you. You stumble into the writhing mass of negative energy. Its tendrils embrace you, burrowing beneath your flesh. As you lay there, you spy a message written in chalk upon the wall. It reads, My name is Cauldrian Air. Cauldrian Air. Presuming then that might be the uh, elf in the king's uniform. Negative energy streams through a tiny fissure, escaping into this world from the Plane of Sorrows. All right, so letting this uh, ethereal leak. Oh, okay. Apparently disinterested, I think. Uh, she's already... ...acquainted with that leak. All right. So thrown into the uh, Steinfor Gen Mine, imprisoned with uh, presumably the other elf. So indeed, in chasing the uh, Kavanaugh Stone, it has led her to him. Although not quite <laughs> under the circumstances I think she would have hoped for. Actually, ready to level up, I think, too. We should probably do that now. Actually, surprised uh, gaining another level. Alright, so third level in Wizard. 